But yeah, I mean, that's a diabolical because, I mean, obviously, that, that, if it is a screw or something or whatever it is, could short circuit something wrong, couldn't it, if it lands in the wrong place? So, you know, it, it's a very serious problem there, Rob, isn't it, guys? G6INU M1 CBK. Well, maybe you have to um, lean the radio forward so you've got the fascia at the bottom so it falls onto the plastic fascia, and then maybe you have to very gingerly put it on a desk and don't touch it ever again. Yeah, no, honestly, Doug, I mean, I was weren't impressed, mate. And uh, the guy who served me, uh, don't get me wrong, the staff are fine, but I won't be mucked off, you know what I mean? So, um, we'll see. We'll do um, they're going to ring Dawn tomorrow, because uh, Dawn actually paid for it on uh, on her card. So, uh, depending on the answer, they're either going to order me a new one, which I'm prepared to wait for, or they're going to refund. So, um uh, I'm not really bothered either way. Uh, if I get one, I get one. If I don't, then I'm not like I'm short of a radio. But uh, just, just severely disappointed with the experience, though. Yeah, OK, Rob, yeah. Yeah, so I assume you've got the serial number of that one anyway. You make sure you've got the serial number, Rob, you know, so you know, you know, if, you know what I'm saying. Yeah, OK, Rob, yeah. No, you, no, you've got to, you know... <laughs> I mean, it's the biggest belief, isn't it, that... Uh, you know, a brand new radio, and they take it back and repair it, like, you know. Um, well, it, it, you know, they, they fair enough, but they've got to sell it as a, 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 B, a, a, as a B stock then, Rob, haven't they, go ahead? Yeah, it gives me a B stock discount on it, but, um, yeah, no, it's fair enough. I'm not, I, don't, I didn't really want to say a B stock radio. I mean, you know what I'm like, Doug. I mean, pretty bit OCD, really, but. None of my equipment I've got here has got any scratches, marks, dents, things, chips. Never has it been abused. Uh, and I've, I wouldn't buy free grade stuff just because it's just, like, just me. But, you know, even when you pay the full price, I don't mind. Anything can go wrong. You could buy a brand new radio and it don't work, right? If it's something simple, like a straightforward problem, yeah, I, I, I'm not, um, not against maybe having that done. But when you're going on from January now, to what we're nearly in April, right? And it ain't nothing's changed. So um, I don't know. It, it, it'll be dealt with tomorrow. But uh, SDR at the moment for me, I'm looking. I'm thinking, well, maybe I won't bother, Doug. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. It does make you it does make you wonder, Rob. Well, I had a similar situation, Rob. That's years ago now. Well, I bought me 870, Rob. My TS 870, and uh, I had it a week, and. Uh, I was, uh, and it turned cold. It turned cold, uh, Rob. I, I, I used to operate in the workshop, you see, and uh, it turned cold, and it, it, it completely died, if you know what I mean, Rob. And uh, it, it was cold. I mean, it was about zero degrees, about about zero degrees. So uh, I knew I knew probably what it was. It was the uh, you know the um, uh, oh god, <laughs> I'm just trying to think now. But, um, you know, the crystal, probably the crystal, the, the, the crystal had uh, stopped working, you know, so so that uh, it, it, the receiver is absolutely dead. So the radio is dead anyway. So uh, directly I bought it indoors and warmed it up, it worked. And directly I put it back in the cold, it stopped. And, uh, 